but really you can get by with your main most of the time. And when you're a low to mid tier player, at the end of the day, it's not the matchup that's making you lose. It's the lack of fundamentals, lack of character specific knowledge, lack of matchup knowledge. So, but anyway, we're getting into this match. Uh, again, surprise, Yo is going Sheik, although he seems to be doing pretty alright so far, I guess. He almost got a sweet needle gun. Grab! Oh, yes, there we go. Great, he was a great read by uh, waiting for the grab. Nice tech. Ooh, not the best edge guard, but alright. Oh, that was a weird trade. Back air. Uh, unfortunately, Sheik has a. Or I guess, fortunately for most people, because. Most people do not like fighting Sheik, but Sheik's recovery is quite balls. <laughs> uh, pretty easy to edge guard, and clearly uh, Cage is aware. Ganondorf also has a pretty bad recovery though. Let's we'll see if Zelda's recovery on the other hand is a lot better. I don't know if Yo's just gonna try to use Zelda now, try to work on a sh Zelda, Shelda, whatever people call it. I don't actually think enough people utilize Sheik Zelda. That was a weird looking kill, but all right. Mm -mm. I think Sheik Zelda used in tan in used together can be quite quite OP. Oh, and so far I feel like Yo Zelda is doing a pretty good job. Mm -mm. I can't say I know. Oh, that was a weird recovery. Mm -mm. But I can't say I know too much about who wins this matchup. You could see it going both ways. If you're in the chat, let me know what you think is happening here. Ooh. A nice job with the fireball. Didn't get the good kill, get a good edge guard off of it though. Nice side B. Ooh, almost. I would have gone for a regrab. Ooh. All right, back throw. Fire. Mm -mm. I don't know if going for the uh, fireball there would have been the best. Oh yeah, I think he is trying to do like a Sheik Zelda duo. Honestly, that's that's really cool. I haven't seen a whole lot of people try to utilize both characters in a single match. And honestly, it can be very hard to deal with. Ooh, almost got the Yodel Gim. But it didn't matter, because Ganondorf isn't coming back from that far anyway. Grab ledge. Ooh, yeah. Down a stock, though. Mm -hmm. But trying to handle the different play styles of Sheik and Zelda. Oh, I thought he was going to get double back here. That would have been really great by Yo. Ooh. Cage is going for some footstools here. Hasn't really done a lot off of him yet, but that could be really good. Footstool dare, I know is a thing. Uh, Ganon. Could be very strong off stage. Nice side B. Ooh, didn't wave land. Nice crack. Down throw. Fair. Yep. That's that's Ganondorf. Oh wow. Confidence. Taking the salty run back. Right on back to Smashville. Yo is confident he should have won there. Or that this is the stage he will, in theory, win on. And he is getting chain grabbed. That was, an, that was a very good little chain grab string there by Cage. So it seems like uh, Sheik was pretty susceptible to that. Mm, not a good player though. Risky forward smash. Uh, it's probably going to make it take a lot. Sheik also very good at tech chasing. Ooh. Good tech by uh, Cage. These needles, though. <laughs> oh, no, that was that could have been an easy fare by Sheik, but Yo misspaced it. Grab, down throw, back it. Oh, didn't space that one right. Mm -mm. He's just trying to get the last hit, <laughs> but Yo is doing a pretty good job deying it. All right. We go see the Zelda now. Again, the duo of these two characters can be quite quite tricky to handle, uh, but it's also pretty hard to play them at the same time because I think Sheik is very much a rushdown character. You know, pretty fast tech chase, all that kind of stuff. Once she gets in, she tends to have a pretty good time. Zelda, on the other hand, is very much a patient, laid back. You're just trying to like keep your uh, opponent out with a variety of and fire and you know the sidekick and all that kind of stuff. And it looks, oh, that's a dead cheek. He tried, uh, Yo tried to make it back on those platies, but it wasn't close enough. Ooh, great dare. Oh, oh, I tried to go for a kick, but Yo did the uh, good gap attack. 
This is interesting because Yo himself is a Ganondorf main, so he should know all the all the tricks that Ganons have to offer. But his Sheik is definitely not as good as his Ganon. But he's doing all right right now. Tried to go for a fair, got hit. Ooh, that was actually that could have been a pretty cool uh, back air. But ended up suiciding. Mm -mm. And it looks like up next we're going to be seeing Yams versus Schmoofy. So that'll be pretty hype. That should be a, probably a chic Captain Falcon. Look at me. Those are two melee players. Yams is a really good melee player, so I'm excited to see that happen. Mm -hmm. This is looking rough for Yo. Mm. Although Cage right now whiffing a lot of moves on shield. I think Yo could have definitely had some shield grabs right there. But it's a clean 2-0 by Cage.